Hello and welcome. This is Camelon4509, and this is another episode of Super Shorts Unhinged. This is, to be specific, the fourth episode of Super Shorts Unhinged. If you haven't watched the first three, you should go watch those. Anyway, we're in limbo where we were last time around, and we have to get out. So that means going down. Like that. You need to reach the bottom of limbo, which is at, like Y20. There's another way to get out, which is you can dig out to the bottom and you'll die. But then you lose all your stuff, and that's not really a great thing. Also, you wind up at your original spawn point, which actually would be better than where I'm going to wind up. In this case, it might have been better for me to just dig out, but in this case, it's fine either way, because I'm going to get out just fine. Like that. Then we'll be teleported some distance from home, um, or rather some distance from our spawn point. In this case, it's actually not nearly as far as I expected to be. I'm about only 150 meters from home, which is not hard to get back from at all. So, I was going to check the dimensional door, see if I could um, go back through it, but apparently... It's no more, which means that I don't get any of the loot from there, which is really kind of sad. But, here I am covered in arrows. I got a bow from a skeleton, which is why I'm showing this off. Uh, here's a wood gear, which I'm going to use for something. Because I found all the stuff I'm going to need for this grindstone, which is pretty cool, and I'll show you why it's pretty cool in just a moment. But first I'm going to need to make... Well, actually, first I'm going to need to place it, and then I'm going to need to make a wooden crank which is the other item we need to make the wooden grindstone work. You put the wooden crank in the wooden grindstone, and then you have, well, a grindstone, which you can use to grind stuff down. For instance, we're going to grind down some iron here, which is going to take eight turns. I don't know if I'm going to skip through them or not. I think I am, but I don't know. Anyway, five, six, seven... Actually, apparently it was eight. Um, anyway, you get pulverized iron, you get two of them, so you double your ore output, and you don't need to do, like, you don't need any diamonds. Anyway, we're going to make an iron saw, which is used to get normal efficiency out of uh, logs. For instance, if I put this log in here like this, I'll get four planks instead of two. And if I put these two planks like this, I'll get four sticks instead of two. Which means that it roughly quadruples my output of sticks per log, which is really awesome. Here's to make a bucket. I do want one of these because I'm going to do something kind of decorative and kind of practical. Mostly decorative, though, in my house. But I'm going to need a bucket to make it work. That way you can make a torch like that, so that's a quick, cheap, easy recipe to get one torch. It's not really as efficient, but if you need a torch, I suppose it's kind of worth it. And we're going to dig out a 3x3 three three space here, so just give me one moment and I'll dig out that 3x3 three three space. I'm going to light up the edges because it's a little dark because I put the torch in the middle there. I'm going to need some sand. You can grind down sand in the grinder grindstone here and you'll get out, obviously, sand, which you're going to need. Because I want, I think, oh, actually no, I just wanted sand for the bog earth. Bog earth is used, well, we need more of that, but it can be used to make, um, I don't know what it's called, but anyway, uh, it's used for peat, and peat can be used to produce various forms of power. But most of that was just decorative. Anyway, that's where we're going to the episode, so I'll see you guys next time. Um, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and yeah, it's been fun. Sorry episodes are taking me so long, i got some personal stuff going on, but hopefully that'll be, you know, resolved enough pretty soon, and yeah, see ya!